Oh, now it's working. Yeah. Move my hand. Beautiful. Well, things have changed a little bit. The wife's car is broken, not my wife, Matt's wife. And it's gotten awfully cold. I can't remember if we had the engine out last time. But anyway, gone through and fixed up some holes, pulled the harness back through, take the booster off, all that good stuff. Trying to get a bit of temperature into it after we, I undercoated it on Monday. It's currently Saturday. Try and put some temperature into it so I can sand it and put another coat of undercoat on. While we're waiting for that to come up to temp, we've stripped down the front, doing a time belt. Was going to do a water pump, but it found out that it looks like it's had a conversion pump put on it. So I'm assuming that since it come from an Aristo, it had a hydraulic fan. So it's been changed over to a non-hydraulic water pump. Gonna do the timing, belt and seals, put the billet tensioner in. And while I had it apart, found the crank trigger wheel had come apart. Well, it was fell off as it came apart, so I've welded that back on. Luckily they have like a little tag there, just there. I don't know if you'll even be able to hear this with the rain. I was turning the film like that. It's pissing down rain. It's about eight degrees. With a heater. We've got the heater that uses all of the electricity to try and warm up what we're doing. Now, what are we doing? Well, a little bit of gold reflective heat tape. The cheaper stuff you can get off eBay, so it'll probably peel off after like one heat cycle, but it looks good. Nice. So we just thought because the dump pipe's gonna run down past here, thought we'd just insulate or at least heat tape up along here and possibly along a bit of the firewall just to try and keep a little bit of heat out of the cabin. And we've got some car builders, um, like a butyl urethane, not urethane, whatever it is. Heat heat shield body so, stuff. Yeah, body dead enough for the inside of the firewall. So we got the pedal box and everything out from in there. We thought we'd do this while we've got all the room, no brake booster, nothing in the road. And this way, brake lines and brake booster and everything go in once the interior is back in. Well, at least the pedal box. So, just been, I did one try. It's quite difficult to get the, um, all the wrinkles out, but we'll give it another go. So, just been. Guess we'll overlap it this way to make it the best. I don't know how far up to go, so we'll start with there. And turn it up and have another go. Should stop your thong melting to the firewall. Hopefully. And me shoe too. Yeah. You're doing well if you can get your ass down there. <laughs> so we've got all the good stuff. Got, the got the car builder's install kit. Comes with all the essentials. Sticker, obviously. Stubby holder. Obviously. obviously. Bottle opener, obviously. Nice little knife. That'll be good for him to cut his fingers with. Got the insulation foil tape. In the roller, which we might even try and use. Thanks. I've got all the interior stripped out now. Uh, I'm going to insulate the firewall. We've got some car builders there. Um, probably try and fix up some of the bits and pieces that have flaked off over the years, but in general, the floor is not too bad. Mm -hmm. 
very small crack over there behind the where the seat mounts. I'll probably just zap that. And um, needs a new windscreen, so just trying to get all this cleaned out. And then the fun job of wiring, but prob engine's probably to go in before all that happens. Um, probably need a new mirror. That one's got a pretty pit shit picture in it. But yeah, it's coming along. But it's five o'clock and it's sleeting, so I think I've had enough for today. So we've got car builder sound editing on the firewall and part way down the floor. Uh, the carpet kit I ordered is pre-moulded and it came with underlay. That's a rotary. Anyway, was it pink? That was a sick Datsun. Is it a Datsun? Yeah, it was like a gun metal grey 120 white boot. Nice. Anyway, carry on. So anyway, I get distracted by things easily. Yeah. Squirrel! So the carpet fits up pretty good. Uh, uses the, well, you've got to put them in, but uses the factory little plugs. You've got to trim it to, to width, but yeah. Works out pretty good. Comes with no hole for the shifter, but you can do that when at your pleasure. Fits really well. Yeah, so we've sound deadened with the car builders. Um, if I could use this bloody gimbal, fucking hell. How, how do I get it to turn again? Like that. Right. 